just back to school season for kids. Adults, it's for you too if you're trying to find new opportunities to advance your career or maybe even find a new one altogether. The Now's Adam Weiner shows us some Tampa Bay area options for you. In a hot garage outside of Ybor, several young men are learning to repair a car engine. It's in the ignition. And most of these students are right out of high school, but some, like Dockery Grogan, took a different path. Well, I did 20 years in Navy, you know, three tours in Iraq, one tour in Afghanistan. That's enough stress over a, a lifetime. So Grogan is now back to school and getting financial aid to pursue a career as an auto and diesel mechanic. In the ultimate goal, I wanted to finish what my dream was when I was 17 years old. As a veteran, Grogan is getting money from the VA to go through the Hillsborough Community College's 15-month-long certificate program. But there are a lot of other options as well. I would think the first move is to come see us, absolutely. Tara Smith of the HAC's financial aid office says a lot of people don't realize how many options there are for people who need help paying to go back to school, including need-based scholarships, child care scholarships, federal Pell Grants, and federal work-study programs. All of them are programs have to be paid back. Any school's financial aid office, she says, should be able to help you find a way to afford it. We are really the, the office that kind of gathers all of that together and explains their eligibility for all of the resources. That's not to say it's going to be easy. Grogan is going to school while still working, making for long 18-hour days. I always remind my wife that this is temporary and that there's a bigger picture at the end. For him, that end is the job he's always dreamed of having. I'm Adam Weiner for the Now Tampa Bay.